Hi everyone, it's Miss McKinney. This is today's read aloud. The title is, This Book is Gray, and the author is Lindsay Ward. Hey, there's no gray in the rainbow, but I just want to help. Well, like, this book is colorful. Sorry, dude, maybe next time? They never let me color. Just one tiny bit of gray? Is that so much to ask? I'll show them. I'm going to make the greatest book ever. Once upon a time, a wolf, a kitten, and a hippo lived in a small house by the sea. Some would describe the house as dismal, bleak, or gloomy, but it wasn't. It was lovely and gray and perfect. Hey, Gray, what are you doing? I'm telling a story. This looks dismal, bleak, and gloomy. Yeah, this is kind of depressing. It's just a little overcast. Perfect weather, if you ask me. Dude, where's all the color? Well, this book is gray, and gray is a color. But you can't illustrate a good story without the primary colors. Yeah, the three of us are, like, really important. Everyone loves us. The wolf, the kitten, and the hippo. Is the wolf going to eat the kitten? Because I feel like that's where this is going. <sighs> of course not. Just because this book is gray doesn't mean it's scary or sad. So, like, what are these animals going to eat if they don't have a proper sun? It certainly won't be organic. I'm guessing the kitten. Do you mind? I'm trying to tell my story here. Hey, what's everyone arguing about? Hey, secondaries, we're discussing Gray's monochromatic disaster. It's about, like, a totally cute kitten who gets eaten by a wolf. Okay, but what's with the hippo? Yeah, dude, we're not sure how he fits in either. Ooh, a kitten! Is anyone listening to me? I said no primaries and no secondaries. This book is gray. What muted his hue? Can I please get back to my story? One day, the wolf decided to host a brunch. Dude, a brunch? Really? That's so last year. I knew that kitten was a goner. Yep, totally saw that coming. Oh, for Pete's sake, the kitten isn't going to get eaten. Who's Pete? I think Pete's the hippo. Personally, I think this book could really use a splash of orange. Orange is a totally rad color. Thanks, Blue. So are you. I know you can't help it, but please stop complimenting each other. It's distracting, and I'm about to get to the... Hey, guys, what's going on? Gray decided to make his own book out of the blue. Yeah, and we're totally blacklisted. No primaries, no secondaries, no color at all. Just because I'm not a primary or secondary doesn't mean I'm not a color. Achromatics have feelings too, you know. Well, White and I are achromatic just like you. So, can we be in your book? Sorry, guys. This book is gray, but maybe... Wait, what are you doing? The wolf was just about to pull the scones out of the oven when... White out! No, no, no! This book is gray, like me! Why is that so hard to understand? You guys get to be in everything. I'm left out all the time. I don't even get to be in the rainbow. I just wanted to show you what I can do. Gray is a cool color too, you know. <sighs> I just get tired of being the one no one wants to color with. Everyone thinks I'm dull, but I can be bold. I can be interesting too. Sorry, Gray. I got a little carried away there. Yeah, ma'am. We're sorry. Sometimes we can be a little off color. How am I going to get rid of all this snow? This book is supposed to be gray, but now it's ruined. No worries, Gray. We can, like, totally help you fix this. That is, if you want us to. 
Even though the wolf's scones burned due to an unexpected weather delay, all the guests had a lovely time together in the garden. It was a great party. Ta-da! Isn't it like totally awesome? And look, we got brown and pink to help us. Dude, gray is such a cool color. I don't know how we never noticed before. Look at all these gray animals. Wow, this book is gray and colorful. I love it. So what do you want to do now? Color? Totally. Me too. Yeah, dude, come on. Hello? Gray, you forgot to end the story. I'm getting hungry. Me too. Mew. Sorry guys, I was coloring with my friends. I'm almost done. Turns out the kitten could whip up a mean brunch. Oh, and they lived grayly ever after. The end. So, what do you guys think? Awesome story, Gray. Easily like my new favorite. Let's read it again. Once upon a time, a wolf, a kitten, and a hippo. This book is pretty great, isn't it?